or time for create mode. And we are going to need your help with this one. We're trying to find this little girl. The thing is, this picture was taken 10 years ago during Hurricane Katrina. Air Force Master Sergeant Mike Maroney helped save this little girl and her family from the rooftop as, as the floodwaters overtook their home. After Mike rescued them, this little girl gave him a hug that, that he has never forgotten, and it's been his mission for the last five years to find her. Now, this is where you come in. He wants you, through the powers of the Internet and the, and the hashtag FindKatrinaKid, to help. He's hoping he can finally be reunited with the little girl. Joining us now is the man himself, Master Sergeant Mike Maroney. Such a great story, man. Uh, we want, first of all, we need to help you find this little girl. What's the latest on the search? It's all over the Internet, but um, yeah. so far they haven't been able to find her. Uh, but like you said, through the magic of the Internet, I think it's only a matter of time until somebody recognizes her or maybe she herself goes, hey, that's me. And then, you know, uh, I, I got to meet her and see how she's doing. Yeah, we're going to ask you to stay, stay just a little still because the, the signal's a little bad. But tell us about this rescue, if you can, and why it holds such a special place in your heart. Well, it was six days after Katrina had happened. Uh, the town's pretty devastated. Uh, I was a little depressed myself just uh, seeing that amount of destruction. And uh, this little girl, when I went to go pick her and her family up, was just a, a light of hope. She was, she was smiling. As her and I were going up the hoist to the helicopter, she's looking down and she's like, there's my house, <laughs> you know, so pointing cute. out stuff. And she's looking around and, you know, I was like, she was she was starting to break my heart right there so we got her up into the helicopter i went down picked up the rest of her family <clears throat> when i got her mom up her mom was afraid of heights and the helicopters are kind of loud and noisy yeah. and shaky and so her mom's pretty scared and the little girl starts rubbing her on the back and saying it's okay mom it's okay mom we're safe now and you know and i'm watching that and i'm like oh man like you know a little tear in my eye on that one and uh, so then we were dropping everybody off at Louis Armstrong International, and we would help people off the helicopter. And when I went to go help her off the helicopter, she wrapped me up in that hug. And all the pain, all the misery, anything that was bothering me at that moment just floated away, and I was in heaven. Sergeant, it looks, it looks like you got people behind you. Who, who are the people that are standing right behind you? Well, so I'm a pararescue instructor now uh, here at Lackland Air Force Base, and these are battlefield airmen. So these are young men. They're going to be TACP, combat controllers, or pararescue men. Just and, like yourself. Uh, they're, they're actually doing a run for fallen uh, comrades of the TACP. And so I, I thought it'd be a, a, a nice gesture if we could all do this and kind of tie it all in. What's up, fellas? Mind. Say hi. Let's go. Hey. <laughs> I like this conversation. Now, you have two boys that are, are close to, to the little girl's age. Do you think of, do you think of her when you, when, you reach, when you reach certain milestones? Sir, I, I think about her probably every day. There's something that reminds me of her. Um, a couple years ago, the students gave me a, a framed picture of that picture, so I have that on my wall. And um, she just, she's a, a light of hope for some dark days. You know, I've been in Afghanistan, Iraq, uh, a couple super typhoons. I've seen a lot of destruction in the world. And that, that smile brightens some darkest nights. So. Well, Master Sergeant Mike Maroney, we thank you so much for your time. We hope you find her. All right, people, this is your chance. The Find Katrina Kid hashtag has been tweeted nearly 2,000 times in the past four days. Now we need your help to keep it going. Be sure to use the hashtag Find Katrina Kid or just head over to the Daily Share Twitter feed and retweet this now.